What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. Yes, man, we are back here with another video. Now, before you do anything, y'all know what I'm about to say. Go ahead and press that like button for you, boy. Please press the like button on this video. Please press the subscribe button if you are new to my channel, which a lot of y'all will be. And also, turn the post notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. Now, as you can see by the title and the thumbnail in this video, we will be talking about Season 8 on NBA 2K22. Y'all know Season 8 come out Friday at 12 eastern time 9 p.m pacific time if you're on the california if you're on the west coast that's when to come out friday at nine now as you can see by the time the thumbnail some of the things that they have in season eight you know season eight now i don't believe it's gonna be bad i just really care about the animation to see what animations gonna they're gonna really release you know new dribble moves and all that but you know we people was talking about it and you know but what you can tell is it's basically just gold. If you've seen the trailer today, they had Shaquille O'Neal with his four championships and all that. And basically what you're going to get is season eight goggles, a basketball jersey, gold arm sleeves, shorts, hats, blah, 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 etc., etc. Now, they do have some of the gold things already in 2K. That's the craziest thing. Like, if you go in the NBA store, they got gold jerseys already of some NBA teams. So it's like, what's the hype about that? Y'all already added that, but you can earn a gold jersey, gold shorts. You can earn it as you progress to level 40 in NBA 2K22 if that's something you want to achieve. I mean, I'm not doubting it, but I just think, you know, if it's going to be a reward, bro, like, you're making it a gold suit, bro. I mean, it's all right. It's a suit. Like, people don't really care about suits as much as they used to because it's just a suit. Like, don't nobody really care about that. Like, they could have did something better. I don't know what they could have did, but making the level for the reward is probably going to be a suit. It's most likely going to be a suit. I forgot what season they did a suit for. I think it might have been like season four, season five. One of them seasons, it was a suit as a level for the reward. And nobody really cared about it. No, they did the season four to reward where it was a suit when it was around Christmas time. I forgot what season that was. Remind me if you know about it. Put it in the comment section. Y'all know what season I'm talking about. I think it was like season two or three. I don't know. But that's when they put a suit as a level four to reward. Now, who in their right mind want to ground for a gold suit? And a lot of people say the reason they didn't put gold rush in because they wanted to add gold into the game, which I can see probably why they would do that but a suit as a reward i mean i'm not really hype about it if we being for real i mean it's a suit bro like for real it's a suit and ain't gonna bring us nothing to the game or nothing but let's get into the other news they got you know as the other news what they're gonna bring is you know as you can go around now they do have some gold shoes you know we had the jackpot this year we had the rollerblades they give you you have the gold carts now they do have some gold turbo shoes now i'm not gonna lie the shoes are gonna look all right they make you speedy gonzalez in the park i'm not gonna lie that's not a bad reward you know it's not that bad than a suit i mean like a suit bro like really the shoes probably gonna be fire i'm not gonna lie you could probably do some videos with those shoes but i don't know what type of video you could do with those shoes but if you be creative you can do something with those shoes but the suit that really just lost me but i knew it was a big possibility it was gonna be a suit or something like that because you know people in the ground community was talking about it like that but the gold shoes you know i'm not really mad about those like i said that's gonna be a nice reward you can really do something with those shoes i mean if you want to race your friend with the shoes on your own i mean hey my boy have fun do what you do now on the cruise ship i wonder if they're gonna give y'all those shoes i don't know if they're gonna give y'all the shoes because y'all know sometimes 2K do like to change the world for current gen and nation. But if people on the current gen can get the shoes too, which they probably will be. But I don't really know because y'all know how 2K is. But if y'all can be, it's not a bad reward, you know. It's, average, it's a better reward than a suit. I'm going to keep saying I'm sorry, bro. But a suit, bro, that's just me. But now let's get into some of the other news. Now they are adding, this is for the my team players right here. If you don't play my team, you ain't going to care about this. But as you've seen in the trailer that they released, they are releasing an MVP 
99 overall bashed out Jokic. Now, if you do play my team, you do know. Jokic is going to be a good car, and that Jokic is eligible to play point guard too, Lord Jesus. I'm telling you, boy. Jokic, they be giving Jokic some good animations, but the only thing about Jokic is it's like his body style. Like, he really can't play defense on 2K. Like, if you add a Jokic on your game, you really not going to be able to play defense. Only reason I say this and know this because I had like a Jokic like that in 2K20. Man, he really couldn't play defense like that. He was all right, the ISO and the dribble and the shoot and, and do everything else. But defense, that ain't really his style. You got to get somebody else. But you see, do see, they do have somebody to pair with that end game whip. Now, if you don't know about that end game whip, boy, you need to look them up. If you play my team, you know about that end game whip. But if you're a part player and you don't know about that end game whip, you need to look them up, boy. Now, they do have a new James Harden end game card coming out, too. Now, if y'all know anything, y'all know James Harden be cooking in 2 Now, that card is going to be nice. I don't know how long he's going to last because he is 6'6". Six, six. And if you think like me, the taller they are, the better they are. You know, if we play my team, I'm trying to run the tallest lineup as possible. I'm not trying to have nobody short of my team. The shortest person I want to have on my team is probably maybe like 6'7". Six, 6'7 seven. Six, seven is the shortest person I want on my, my team. But that end game, James Harden is going to be good for content for the my team players. Now, the 2K actually put enough time and effort into my team as they do park the park will have way more content and views it'll have a lot more things because my team boy them boys been eating over there i ain't even gonna lie to you them boys have been eating on the content they get a new they get something new every week every week they getting something new and crazy and they kept the park updated like that just do something i don't know what they could do some i mean the events be all right but they do the same like three events on next year so ain't nobody really trying to play that Rival day, bro. Nobody want to play that. You can't even want to win streak in rival day. Who wants to do that? That's stupid. But if they could do something for Park as the same as they do for my team, the game would be jumping way more. And it would have a lot more views. I promise you that. But this is mostly the best of the videos basically for the my team people. Now, these are the players you can get once season eight comes out. Invincible Jerry West, you know. Ju I mean, Julius Irving, other players like that. Now, they're going to be me. I mean, they are invincibles, but to each his own. Whichever player you want to choose is just best for your lineup. Hey, my boy, you do you on that. I ain't going to trip on that. But, you know, I mean, you ain't really beating people if you got tall lineups. Like, I'm telling you, man, if I had a my team lineup the way I really wanted it, man what i know that invincible luca go crazy if y'all don't know about invincible luca luca probably got the best jump shot base on 2k and i say this i don't know about park but if you're a 5 7 mid you could probably use it right but luca got the best jump shot in the game i don't even want to cap to you his jump shot arc is so high you can't contest it i don't know how like that has never been a thing in 2k where somebody jump shot arc is so high you can't contest it you cannot contest lucas jump shot base if you don't believe me go look at some of my team videos i promise you you cannot contest his jump shot base it's impossible you can be dead in his mid and they might give you a 10 percent contest i'm telling you i've seen it before it's crazy what luca can do on this game but Luka and other Invincibles, you know, it depends on who you really want to use. But some of those Invincibles are going to be very useful for some people and they line up. Like I said, man, I'm telling you. Here's the list again. You can get Invincible Pete Mavich and get Invincible Grant Williams and everybody else on the list. But, yeah, man, that's really it for Season 8. Let me know how y'all feel about it. Let me know if y'all going to really grind for it or not. Me, I might grind for it, you know, you know, for content, really. But... That's really it for the video, man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you are new to my channel. We're still out here trying to hit 70 subs before the summer ends. Please hit that button if you're new, man. And I'm out, man. Peace.